hogs on the mile planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body old school for low. Purple rim, seven seven cutty, black all with right, the purple. good, Ravens fam? So we off the bye week now. Hopefully you all enjoyed the bye week like I did. Um, yeah. So let's just uh, get to it. Uh, Ravens versus the Carolina Panthers. Um, PJ Walker is out. Uh, Baker Mayfield. We're back at Baker Mayfield again. Um, after the uh, commanders got them all them flags from the refs, you know, to help that win. Uh, could Carolina Panthers get the same thing with the Ravens? Don't know. I'm interested to see uh, how DJ Moore is going to do against us. Uh, Brian Burns, I think that's his name, the pass rusher with Carolina. Um, but we know Baker. Baker knows us. But the thing about that, I think Baker only beat us one time. Beat Lamar one time, I think. Beat Lamar one time, I think. Yeah think one time maybe two i don't know if i'm like wrong whatever i know y'all put it in the comments but this game is going to be interesting um i really don't be real with y'all i really don't have no feeling about this game i believe we're gonna win i believe it's gonna be competitive um i'm really really excited to see how the, the ravens defense is gonna be uh, mainly with Raquan, um, two weeks under his belt now, I believe. Let's just go with two weeks. Two to three weeks under his belt now for as far uh, as learning the defense and everything like that, knowing more plays because the defensive play calling has been getting better. Now, as far as the offense, we've been stale. Um, run game been good, but the passing is pretty dull. But Gray Roman is not a passing guru. Um, so it's going to be interesting. Uh, Deshaun Jackson, hamstring. Uh, we're going to see if D Rob and um, Lamar is going to have that connection again. Hopefully they can get a better connection because Lamar owed that man two touchdowns. He had two touchdowns right there and he missed them. But. Yeah, just I just really know Panthers three and seven, so I just I don't know. I really don't know. They won a last week game, but I don't know. You just never know. I never. I know a lot of people have said, "I mean, it's gonna be a cakewalk. We should go undefeated." I'm um, after bye. You never know. I seen someone tweet out. I can't remember the person that tweeted out. My apologies. But they said, the people that's on that other side of the field, they have mortgages, they have family, they have ego, they have pride also. So that doesn't mean they're going to sit there and fold. So, and you see, look what the commanders did. You know, the referees helped out a lot. But look what the commanders did. But still, so, Yeah. You just never know. So, uh, but I do have the Ravens winning this game. Us going undefeated. Let's just see how things turn out. The Bills lost to the Vikings. The Commanders beat the undefeated Eagles. So you just, you just don't know. You know. You just uh, Seattle. They was on a hot streak. They lost against Tampa Bay. The Cowgirls lost against. The five losing streak of Green Bay. And I, ooh, I was celebrating for Green Bay, too. Ooh, if y'all saw me. If I was live, man, because y'all know I hate them cowgirls. Anyway. Uh, but, yeah, we're going to see. <sighs> Boy, that was just a long week, though, without, without the Ravens football. But that was one of the most stress-free Thursday, Saturday, Monday. It's been for a long time. Oh, that was so ooh, it was relaxing. Just sit back and watch games and just doesn't care who win or loss. Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. But that's over with now. <laughs> Everybody hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the share. 
Everybody stay safe. God bless.